Okay, uh, <laughs> let's see how we can drive a formula for liquid pressure. The one which says that uh, pressure is uh, the product of density of liquid, height of that liquid, as well as um, acceleration due to gravity. Mano, chomo tu kizwa ni pressure. Pressure uh, is equal to force exerted per unit area. But if you can remember very well, second law of motion, Newton's law. Uh, force is equal to the product of mass and acceleration. So we have mass and acceleration. That acceleration is due to gravity. So instead of writing force, we can substitute as well as the uh, mass and acceleration. So from our formula, pressure here, pressure is equal to um, mass times acceleration due to gravity. The good we are done, then divide by area there. But uh, the common form of is uh, density, density of liquid, density or density of substance. Density is given by uh, mass over volume. Mass over volume. So if you can make mass subject to formula, then you are going to multiply both sides by volume. We also do them send the volume. Turn to the good uh this one, this one will cancel. So we did that selling the um mass mass is equal to desit desite times volume. Desire times volume. Now, uh, per minute value mass is about seven liters per gram. Desire times volume. Then, so the good idea is a pressure. Pressure. Pressure is equal to desire times volume there and gravity. This thing say what is gravity? Will you? So we are going to put it there gravity here. That's gravity. Then over area, over area, and then she made the bang. Um, the gap of the volume of solid, the bang of bunch. Uh, from vol volume of prism is given by area times uh, perpendicular height. Area times perpendicular height. Let's say we did find the volume of the cube is volume of cube. So she made the bang. Our cross section here that's a uh, uh, square. So the base area is given. Can I do that? I must have height of. So the so volume of volume of gent, volume of substance, or volume of solid is given by uh, volume is equal to cross section area times perpendicular height. Don't use a good perpendicular volume. The carbon gas absorbing area times height. So, you uh, multiply by is that the pressure. Pressure is equal to density times um, area times height times height times gravity. So we have uh, gravity there. So this is our um, gravity. So this is gravity. Don't forget to divide it by area from the general formula. Pressure is equal to density times area times height times gravity. And now we can see that um, the area we use area, so we can cancel that one. If we cancel that one, they would use and the uh, pressure. Pressure is equal to density times height times gravity. Which can be written as P is equal to uh, D H G as uh, our formula which was needed there. So if you have enjoyed my video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And if there's any question you could send the any subject in any topic number and domain uh eight eight two four three five five six two. That's my number. So that's it for this video. Thanks for watching and uh, have a nice play.